Holy shit, guys. I... I... <laughs> I just don't even know. I honestly just don't even know. This is the best game ever. Such good luck. Holy cow, we're set. We're good for life. No gobble gums. Remember that. No, no gobble gums, guys. This is a gobble gums, a no gobble gums challenge. My cat really just wants to eat the cords. We don't. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. I have a cold. We don't have speed cola, so this is going to be a little bit risky when it comes to these weapons because they are slow to reload. But oh, the shadows, my, my loyal servants arise, guys. This is such good luck. This is such a good game. Oh my goodness. I cannot make this up. You know, I got the Draken, and I was like, you know what? I will be fine with the Draken. If it gives me, like, a Mana War or something, I'm sticking with the Draken. But it gave me the Ragnaroks. It gave me a Dingo. This is just crazy, guys. Man, I wish... Okay, all right. Nope, nope, nope. You can't... You cannot attack that. I'm sorry, cat. I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to move you. You are being a little bit of a pest, so... Ugh. Hey, buddy. Hey, look. Say hi. Say hi to everybody. Hello. Oh, could you hear him whimper? You can hear him whimper. Okay. Well, let's just do this thing. And there is my max ammo. There we go. And we should be able to open this up now, too. Yep. Hey, stop it. Do I have to lock him up? That things are seriously out of whack. Business as usual, I suppose. All right, let's just do this. We're going to be training in the cafeteria. I'm going to pick this up just for the sake of picking it up, even though I can't build it. But, guys, this, this is it. We're so, we're so set up. If I got Widow's Wine, that would have been even luckier. I'm, like, extremely overpowered right now. Like, I don't think I can be stopped. And a death machine. Here we go. He jumped up onto my computer. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe how perfect of a start we got. It was absolutely perfect. All before round five. We got four perks all before round five. We got a dingo, and then we also got the Apothecan Serpent. Come on, buddy. Stop. <sighs> Look at the Cherry Fizz camo. I love the Cherry Fizz camo, dudes. Love it. Absolutely love the Cherry Fizz camo. The Astrula Astoth. And remember, we cannot use this pad because we have to stay in Mob of the Dead. Because we are doing the Mob of the Dead challenge here on the Map Revelations. Back at it again once again, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. My name is Pimp Panther. I won't see you in the next one because we're not ending it right here. We're going to go on at least to like round 50 or something. The only thing that I could see going wrong is if uh, we run out of ammo. That's really it. I I mean, we're probably, we're probably set against the Panzers. We're probably set against the Marguas, the Marguinos. Like, I I don't think we're going to die. I honestly don't think we're going to die as I as I start to get punched a whole lot in the clit. GG's. <laughs> it is it is GG at this point in time, guys. This is wonderful. This door. This door better lead to the underground laboratory. The underground laboratory. Uh, the infirmary. That's definitely not how it looked in Mob of the Dead, but whatever. You know, if they, if they had a staircase leading up, I, w I would make that more believable. Because that's where the staircase was. Oh. Yep, because double points is exactly what I need right now. Because I can totally go and pack, like, pack punch and everything. Man, if only we could have pack a punched. To be honest, I may have been able to open up the entire map. But I couldn't have pack a punched. So that's, that's the thing, you know, like, you you have enough points to where you can do shit, and you can, like, open up the map and everything, but there's not going to be a possible way for you to pack a punch. I mean, unless you get extremely lucky with all of the double points in the world, and then you get, like, nukes at the very end, and you still have double points, and you get, like, 800 points for the nuke, 
But other than that, I don't think there's a chance that you can pack a punch for this challenge. If you can do it, if you can do it, like upload that shit and 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 post it in the comments. Like, if you can pack a punch before round five, or on round five, I guess at the end of round five, beginning of round six, if you can pack a punch before then and get back here in Mob of the Dead and be as well set up, then please, please upload that because I want to see that. I want to see your skill because that's that's some pretty good zombie playing right there, but. Right now we're just kicking it round 10. You know, it's like it's nothing, guys. Like it's absolutely nothing. I haven't even used this thing. With Takeo? Are you guys excited for Black Ops 4? Because I know I definitely am. I know I'm super excited. I mean, guys, we get four maps on release. I'm just gonna do that because I haven't used this thing once. And there's a, oh, nuke. Might as well just get it. Because it's not like anything else matters at this point. But I'm super excited for Black Ops 4. I'm so excited for Blood of the Dead. Um, if I am able to stay home and stream all day, like from morning to night, or I guess morning to, I guess, midday, because I'm probably going to want to take a break. I'm probably going to want to spend some time with uh, with my lady. Uh, what map do you guys want to see me play first? So your, your choices are Blood of the Dead, Classified. Actually, wait, no, I'm not going to have Classified at that point in time. Because I, if I buy just the $60 game, because there's no way I'm spending anything more than that. Yeah, okay, so your choices are Blood, uh, Nine, and Voyage. I'll have to wait to play Classified until I actually get the my Mystery Box Edition. That way I can redeem the, uh, the Black Ops Pass, and then I can get Classified. But I'm not going to spend an extra $100 on a game just to play it a few hours earlier if I manage to get the day off, so yeah, that's that's kind of what's going on. My pets are doing something weird in the background. That is now like the staple of my channel, it's just, oh, my pets. Oh, max ammo. Oh, good, because I have one shot left with the dingo. What the hell? They're playing with the shutters. Nice! Nice. Nice. We're so set. Honestly, if I don't die before like round like 25, I think I'll just end it there. Because, I mean, there's not really a whole lot else I can do. Like, this isn't really even a challenge. Because I'm so well set up. Oh, here's the Margua. But watch this. I'm just going to screw this guy up. Well, okay, they're screwing up the blinds. There's the parasite. Just get rid of you. <laughs> this is so easy. Welcome to the hardest challenge on Revelations, guys. Oh shit! 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 shit. Okay, I'm getting cocky. Hi was Hi was definitely getting cocky. Oh, he closed his mouth. And Mark was dead. And there's an insta kill and a max ammo. Let's just use these for the hell of it. Bah! 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 I'm trying to kill this stupid fly. Bah! 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 Can I really not kill him because he's not on the ground? Probably. I mean, it makes sense. That Margua didn't stand a chance. I was a little bit scared. I you could you could tell I clenched I clenched a little bit. I was a little a little freaked out, I will not lie. I know who I know who you are. But what questions, questions remain. remain? Why do you do the things you do? The way you do the, the or the how, how does it go? The way you do the things you do. I think the Shadow Man is probably one of the best villains of all time. What? Okay, alright. Post in the comments below, guys. Who do you think Dr. Monty is? Do you guys think Dr. Monty is a good guy? Do you think he's a bad guy? Do you think he is the devil, Satan, Lucifer, uh, Beelzebub? Just, just tell me. Dr. Monty? It's just, it's too easy, guys. This 
probably isn't even entertaining to watch, to be honest, because this is just so easy. Tell me like a hell cut.